So we need to know a little bit more about you and your thoughts and my thoughts. <laughs> Did I just <laughs> talk enough? <laughs> no, you. Uh, what was that? Sorry. What is that? <laughs> like so. So what was it that? Okay, so you moved to Iceland. Um, and you started Are you asking me again why I'm here or is that different? No, 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 <laughs> no, no. no we, we, we understand a little bit about it, but, but it's like, so you moved to Iceland and you started your life there, but then the, I guess there was another step or was it always that you were looking for something else? Because from what I've seen in your videos, you seem to be very spiritual, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. And so were you always spiritual or did you find your spiritual side in uh, Iceland? I was always a spiritual. I was always spiritual. Okay. That's why, that's why it blew my mind as a fan. You know, I, I was so, I know there are many, you know, spiritual people doing great stuff online, but uh, I'm mentoring that they are really taking seriously, that your mindset is everything and take care of your energy is everything. Surround with the right people is everything. Yeah. You know, that really can talk and openly apply in business. I, I never saw something like that. You know? That's when I so select a friend. That's why we are where we are. That's yeah. why we are here. Yeah. You know, at the end, my, my selection with friends, it was about, oh, so I'm very straight, and but I'm very sensitive, right? I don't offend people. But I need the connection and I need to, you know, in the intimacy that you can connect with somebody for real. Yeah. So the people that they were fake, you know, so I click with people very beautifully uh, because they just go in that state. Oh, I feel good with you. I can be myself. But some people, they were so fake that they didn't know how to talk to me. Exactly. Uh, because they got confused. So I also feel bad about it. Like I'm not playing the game and I also sometimes feel bad about you don't fit. And later I start to embrace and embrace it more and I see that great people and great leaders are themselves and you know, and later you can see people that they are real. They are the only ones around you. And the business that you do is this type of people. And we are here in this interview, you know, being real. <laughs> and this, this is how, because you cannot do it anymore yeah. with, with fake relationships. You know? True, yeah. true. That's this big shift. We have to wait yeah. for this in the next one. The big shift now is actually like how people are walking from competitive to collaborate. Yes. Yeah. And, and now they start to taste it. I remember my father, he told me once, it's a beautiful saying, and I always try to believe it, but life proved me wrong all the time. You know, people are thinking of themselves and they can always, you know, find ways in their own interest and self-serve. But there are a saying that says, if the, if the good people, no, if the bad people knew how good business is to be good people, they will just behave good yeah. because it's a good business. Do you know that it's kind of like people are waking up and you can yeah. see this in other groups, you know, telling you the only way to long last is to be true. The only way to do, to be popular is to be real and to be yeah. value. Yeah. So at the end you have to be good, be loyal, be consistency, be someone that, you know, that it's, um, have a you know like a death about you yeah. to be able to be it goes together you don't have to be an evil twisted you know yeah. uh, horrible selfish person to make it exactly yeah. okay. so Tarzan in black and white the guy that was Tarzan and Becca you know epic and this guy he was a skinny sick guy in school so this guy, he just like maybe the parents uh, got advice from the doctors to go and train and to go swim every day because he will get healthier and stronger. And he, guess what he did? He go all the way, right? All the way until he became a champion and later he became Tarzan in the movies, Yeah. right? So what, what happened here? We are talking about your weakness, that the, the final of the story is when my sister sometimes always reminds me, your weakness is your strength.
but w w what led you to um, finding your own business? It was a, it was more like I have some ideas and later I realized how complicated it can be. So I, I do still have some ideas later on. I have like a, a two books that they are into halfway to finish. And I want to oh, have the motivation. Your own books? Yeah, yeah. And I want to have the motivation to, because mo now I have so much info that I need to put it out. Yeah. <laughs> but I am not like the writing type. And I learned so much about discipline and believe it. And I learned so much in the process. And I, I this is what I do as a fan. I can see other people inspired to maybe finish projects or create something just because SFM, you know, nurtured you just about you, something like yeah. that. Yeah. But later, of course, I believe in affiliation and I'm very excited to, you know, be good in, I create my channel. So I want to, I am very inspired now into going that direction, I embrace it. I feel a lot of um, insecurity. I feel insecure about my accent. I speak fast, I'm supposed to speak more slow because I I can be rambling and speaking wrong English and blah blah blah. All this I don't think I think I don't think that's an issue. No. To be no. honest. No. I don't think I don't think you should even consider that as an issue. No. I, I try exactly. So I, I was with having these good feedbacks. This is a limit belief, forget about it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would say, and I say this to, to a lot of the women that, that uh, within the SFM, uh, actually Veronica was one that I said to, and I say, and I, I encourage them to start a YouTube channel because it seems like a lot of women that I've spoken to in SFM are hesitant to do that for some reason. I would say, I, I, I would say yeah, that there are many right? reasons. There's many reasons. First is the fear and to be, you know, still I don't open my comments. I'm not brave enough to open my comments. Mm. And I have to, I have to develop a channel, feedback, yeah. like my video, say something, and I know it will be some maybe good and ugly comments, mm. you know, and I have to deal with that. Yeah. So I, I think, think it's the fear of the bad publicity. I'm playing safe because I'm speaking in English. I think my, my out of the comfort zone is to really grow my channel and some playlists for Spanish. Mm. And now is when I'm in the spotlight and they will destroy me, I'm telling you. They can you be more so? mean, even as even you say that they can be mean or whatever, the Scandinavian, they are, can be more raw and more harsh. And it's a lot of, uh, they really no filter in the way they can come in the Spanish people. So I, I will also deal with that, but I will try to give some value real and I just hope there will be cool people that follow me. I think, I think if you concentrate on, and I always say this, you are not going to make, you're not going to please everybody. Right. You know, it doesn't matter what I put out there. There's going to be some people that like it, some people who don't like it. And if I allow the people who don't like it to to shut me down, there's going to be a whole lot of other people that could have benefited from what I had to say. You know, from our point yeah, of view. Yeah, now, now I start to embrace it that I think I, I, you know, I'm expressing myself and I look okay. And I am like, okay, it's fine, you know, because all these issues that you look at yourself and I don't know, you're talking like this or you're talking like that. Yeah. I'm started to, that's why I get excited and I'm like, okay, I'm, go I'm going for it. I'm going yeah. to do it. And, and I just still want to polish my niche, like what exactly I want to grow, because many people are talking many interesting things and I'm not talking any different, but maybe it can be with my type of view. Uh, I'm doing now the 14 day challenge of public speaking with Christine okay. and it really pushed me because I'm publishing every day which you just maybe need once a week and it is, it's hard work so I'm just trying to be value short and you know um, yeah. and let it go uh, and it's, I'm learning so much with myself like hey this is coming you start to have a structure and you start to be more like colloquial and you know because and I start to accept that uh, I'm excited that this girl, I start to accept it. I'm doing this, you know. Yeah. Okay. I mean, the, 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 the point is to get from where you are and to be there, like, like in the image of you have a certain image of yourself, right? Yeah. There's a lot of fights that have to take place, I feel, you know, with yourself because you have to, you have to get yourself up and get yourself in front of that that computer or that camera 
and exactly. make that video because every time you make that video you become better and better so and just better. but just by this growth that you will take in the process is worth it exactly yeah. Just all the things that you're going to learn about you, about people, about it's so it's so given, it's so yes. rewarding that even though you could maybe get you know your spot out there or maybe be average, it was so it was so cool how much you learned. Yeah. So in my head now I'm trying to be practical, you know, in the sense of you know I'm in my 40s, so I am into the I'm going to the affiliation. I think it's cool. I'm going to try a video. I think this is a practical way to go, but I'm going to do this channel because yeah. I want something interesting and I'm growing. And I'm going to, you know, and I try to imagine and be smart into different, you yeah. know, streams, but also not, uh, you know, also like realistic into if you try much, you lose a lot and you don't grow well and you lose energy. So, yeah, I'm, I'm just trying to be, um, Logically, my plans and to follow the steps every day and not put too much on my plate. You know, some people do the super goals and and I know it's not realistic. And yeah, I think we're in the same place. Because yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm there as well. I'm like, just take every step at a time. Yeah. No rush, but just go with the flow. So you had a question. And this is a lot of learning now. It's a lot of learning to feel that you are productive but you're not stressed and it feels weird exactly. yeah. and this is what you want to do i want yeah. to do that but i feel weird should i do something more no I, no it's good this is good you know it's all this because it's testing new so it's like wow you grow so much as um yeah you know what i mean your your ne neuro cells are connecting in different mm. way of of living and working yeah. right yeah Sorry, no, I was going to say, I think we had like a couple of years of trying to do so many things at the same time. Mm. And one of the things we decided for this year was to just like minimize, try to do one or two things and do it well, you know. Um, but what I was going to say was when it comes to the whole like self-doubt, you know, if you look at all the cafe clutches, a lot of these people, they, they, they sound so good. They have so many nice things to say, right? They come across as really, really cool people. They are really cool people. But almost every single one, it's somewhere the in the thing. conversation, s talks about how much self-doubt they have, you know? And every I think, single one of them. And I think unfortunately as women, especially, we have a bit of a victim complex going on. You know? That's true. I That's think it's true. very, because you were saying like, oh, but you know, men, this, but I'm a woman and this. I think we, well, we men have it as well. Yeah, yeah, but mm. yeah, everyone has their own thing, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I think women have, women have an idea that they're victims and that everything is going to be harder for them which may or may not be true but just thinking it's going to make it harder you know um exactly just to think it will make it harder because a limited belief yeah. i will right. go back on that but finish i think unfortunately one problem with being a woman and this has been psychologically tested i think one pro problem with being a woman is like we are by nature maybe a little bit more nervous than men Right? You know how we can overthink things a little bit and sometimes guys will just be like, I'll do this. If it works, it works. If it doesn't work, it doesn't I work. Know. You know? <laughs> I know. I hate that. And, I hate, and you know, and you know, and you know the difficult now that I have with some friends to not be able, they fall so much into the equality that mm -hmm. they don't understand that we are different. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah. we are different. I want the same equality. You get Value wise. Me, yeah. Yeah. But you, we are not the same and it makes me yeah. a lot of peace with myself and with the other to understand it's yeah. not less or more different yeah. type of intelligence right yeah and this is so this is so true and actually sometimes it bothers me i'm thinking about yeah look at this guy he's start like me when i compare myself i compare with men mm. yeah because i remember starting with that guy and i'm very sure i have many other things going on mm. he focused he maybe did for three video ads in one week mm. and it took me a month and blah 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 and he go all the way i think sometimes it's insane because i don't function well when they say no i was like three days with the nights working straight that's mm. men they just focus and go all the way so in that sense they really get achievements when they put their head into it when they decide yeah, yeah, okay yeah, i decide yeah, yeah, this yeah. and they go so yeah. why are we going to take this away this is true and it bothers me because we are you know not like that and I yeah. have to embrace the other good things that we have. I think women need to get out of their own way. Because I think women have, again, this 
victim complex where they think that men are trying to sabotage for them, but actually we're sabotaging ourselves yeah. in a way. And maybe this no, biology. No, I don't think they are against me. They're not against yeah. me. But the nature, they make them grow better and faster because the way they work. Yeah. Yeah. But because I'm not we, thinking we can... they are against me. Huh? They know yeah. It's no, but a lot of women do seem to think that. That the patriarchy is against them. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, but, but I say, I think uh, women yeah, yeah, are a bit more true. nervous. We overthink things, like, right? And another thing I think we do is that when something doesn't work out, I remember Rich Francis said he made like 50 YouTube videos before he made one that worked really well. I think for a lot of women that I've spoken to, um, when something goes wrong, we think that there's something wrong with us. Whereas when something goes wrong for a man, they see, okay, shit, something went wrong. I'll try something else. You know what I mean? We take yeah. th we take it more personally and, and end up thinking that there's some something that is against us, whereas we're like too self-conscious about what we're doing and just not getting out of our way and trying things and being brave and not really giving a shit until it works. <laughs> Do you see yeah. what I'm saying? But I'm more in that stage now. Of course, I'm more into the... When I'm talking with all the members and people like in this type of community, you are like, oh, try that. Oh, it didn't work. Oh, don't mm. worry. You have to try this other way. Yeah. It wasn't... I can see that you can see uh, women doubt themselves, like men doubt themselves, and some women like more straight mm. as men. So you can see personalities. I try oh, yeah, to yeah. differ difference, you know, that, and we also talk about like we are individuals. I like that. Mm.